Hey guys, this is Katie. Um, today I'm going to show you my setup for my cloth diapers. Um, I have a one year old in cloth diapers and I am also 25 weeks pregnant with my third daughter. Um, this isn't all the diapers. Um, today is diaper laundry day, so some of the diapers are in the washing machine right now. Um, this is the changing table. Um, I just have like some nose stuff because last week my little girl's, uh, her name's Molly. Her nose was kind of acting up, so I had some boogie wipes and a little, a little bulb syringe and some um, little noses. And um, this right here is um, it's coconut oil mixed with lavender, and they say it helps with like congestion and everything like that for babies. So anyway, I just have my little mats right there. Um, down here, this is just three of my flips. I think I have maybe eight flips. And I just got the newest one in the mail, the Love My Fluff, or Love, what is it? Love My Diapers, maybe? I can't remember. Anyway, it's the new flip one. So I stick my flips in here, and they're stuffed with um, flats and flower sack towels. Um, these right here are my one-year-old's prefolds. I have seven of them. And then these are the 24 small prefolds for my newborn. Here are the six flats for my new newborn as well. Um, right over here are just a couple of other um, covers. Uh, this is the... Which one is this? I forgot. The, uh, the Sweet Pea. And this is the Nikki's cover, and I have them also stuffed with flats and flower sack towels. Here are my two wool covers in here. Um, plan on ordering some more. Down here is just like some books and toys and things like that for my one-year-old. And right here is my uh, diaper pill. I It's empty right now because I just put the diapers in the wash. Um, I keep it cornered like this so that my one-year-old doesn't try to get in there and play with poop. She's never tried, but she is crawling and pulling up, and I don't want her to do it. And also down there, I have a little scented candle. Um, I just think it helps with the smell sometimes. I usually don't have odor. I mean, I really don't ever smell anything, but if there's like three poops in here or more, then it can kind of stink. So I do keep that little scented candle down there. And right here is where I keep um, all the little whatnots. Um, back here is the wipes that I've made. They're dry in case I need something, um, in case I need to just dry something off like her face or whatever. Here's where I keep my uh, wipes. I'm seeing if I can reach one down in here. <laughs> um, I usually have them folded so that they'll come out. Um, and I'll make another video for that later of uh, my wipe process. But anyway, there's my wipes warmer. Um, snappies, boingos, haven't used them yet. Um, this right here is coconut oil. That's like some leftover CJ's butter. There's not much in there. These are like little containers that came from Target. I love them. Um, as soon as this one is actually empty, I'm just going to keep some coconut oil in there and put it in my purse. This right here I put on to like protect her bottom from rashes. It's um can't really see it. It's uh CJ's butter, the the shea butter balm. It smells really good. It's um like oats and honey or something. Here's my noise maker for when she takes naps in here. Um here's like some backup coconut oil that I refill those small containers in. Um right here I just got this little container. Um, I think it was from Home Depot. It was on sale like a year ago. I don't know. These are some uh, receiving blankets folded up. I probably, I mean, I usually have it stocked up to about here. It's almost full usually. And I put those in my covers whenever I get through with whatever's in there, the flower sack towels and the flats. And I just um, stick one of these in there and line it in there. Um, here's just some dry wipes I have for whenever those run out and I need to wet some more I'll just um, wet some this is my newborn stash of covers 
This is um, an Etsy cover that I recently ordered. I thought it was going to fit my one-year-old, but it doesn't. So I'm just going to use it for my new baby girl. This is a cute little cover. Um, a friend of mine gave it to me um, right after I had my little girl, and I used it for probably about three months. It is technically a sized diaper cover, and it has the Velcro and the little semi-waterproof lining. I wouldn't let her wear it for too long because to me I felt like it was going to leak. But this was the back of it and I just thought it was super cute um, when she wore it. And I only would like let her wear just this and it was just super cute. Um, here's my little, what's it called? Peri bottle? I can't remember what it's called. And I just keep watering it just in case I need to spray off a diaper. I'm actually waiting for a diaper sprayer to come in the mail next week. Um, this is my um, diaper dog collar that I got this week in the mail. So I will put it on the diaper sprayer. These are my diaper dogs. Oops, sorry. Right here. Pink and purple. And, um, you know, like thermometer, nail clippers, little comb, um, things like that. And also, I forgot to show you, down here I have um, more of the changing pad covers. I keep them in there. And then like the little mats that I put to help kind of waterproof. I change those more often. I put those right there. Okay, so now for the diapers. Um, I try to color coordinate. I, I have a little bit too much fun with that. But um, basically here's all the diapers um, that I have. They're mostly pocket. Um, a little bit of all-in-one diapers. And these two right here are two out of four of my fitteds that I have. The other two are in the wash. These came, these are, um, I think they're called boosters. They came from the same shop that made this diaper, the Teeny Textiles. And she only did like two orders, or that's all, all I've seen. And it's kind of new, so I'm really excited to order some more. But it's just a bunch of, you know, the, the animal kind of forest prints. Um, that one is super cute. But, um, yeah, I love those. And these... This, like, this is my best bottom. I have two, so this is my other one. And then, like, some, there's one insert. It's a hemp insert. These are fleece liners, extra fleece liners, and there are two more hemp inserts down there. And right here, you can kind of see uh, some of my CJ's butter. I just keep them right there for whenever I finish another one. Just keep them in there. And then... There's a little Disney princess kitchen. And I'm going to go in here to the bathroom and just show you a little um, what I do in the bathroom. This is like the only thing I really use micro uh, fiber inserts for is to clean. Um, if I ever make a mess in here whenever I'm dunking or swishing or soon to be spraying, um, I made an all-purpose cleaner and I'll show you what's in that later. Um, anyway, I just kind of spray everything, pull one of these wipe it down, clean it, and then I put it in my Planet Wise wet, wet bag. And I have three that I hang from here because these are the ones that snap. And that's what I love about the snap ones. So anyway, um, that's that. As far as the cleaning, um, if you have any questions... Oh, wait, let me show you my wet bag, sorry. Um, in here in her closet, I love little storage container things like this. I have like hats and bloomers and socks down there. Um, this are, oh, this right here are two swim diapers that she has. Um, her bathing suits and towels. I don't really use those towels anymore. I just I think I'll use them for the newborn because she's kind of a little bit too big now. There's like some sheets that I really don't even use. I don't know if I have them. Oh, yeah, like pack and play sheets. That's what I have. Here are my wet bags and pill liners. I have four pill liners total. I think like five wet bags. I can't remember. Uh, anyway, and then of course there's some hair bows. So that's all. Oh, there's another wet bag. I love this one. It's the owl from Alva. This was a handmade right here. I'm just going into my diaper bag. Um, this was a handmade from uh, Etsy. And I love the size of it. I was using, I think it was a Planet Wise, but 
it wasn't tall enough or wide enough and this one is a little bit taller and a little bit wider than the planet wise and it fits my spray bottle and my wipes that I have in there so that's all if you have any questions um, please put them in the comments below thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a great day thanks bye